And with that revelation from Beacon Intelligence in mind, the Pan-Africa Youth Union is challenging President Mohamed Buhari to ask questions from the Central Bank of Niger, Central Bank Governor, Ministers of Finance, Budget and National Planning, uh, Defence and Education on why the country is in a rapid decline. The group says if nothing is done, they will be left with no other option than to stage a youth conference where they will be encouraged to protect themselves against terrorist Helen Osamede Aikens reports. Insecurity in Nigeria is now taking alarming dimensions with an upsurge in attacks by terrorists across the north, now threatening the well-being of citizens. It is of grief concern to all well-meaning Nigerians who wonder how the country arrived at such a situation where no one is safe. Many have come up with ways they believe the government can handle the situation. Pan-African Youth Union is suggesting that the federal government summons those at the helm of affairs of the nation's security, finance and education sector to respond to Nigerians on the reason for the nation's steady decline. To have resigned by now, you cannot be a CBN governor for over six, seven years and dollar continue to increase from less than 200 to now becoming over 700. And even if the president is unaware, you who is managing the affair should know that this thing has gone beyond my capacity and honorably resign. They give government seven days to some of these ministers or have the union call for a nationwide youth conference where the youth will be informed on the needs to defend themselves and their territories from terrorist attacks. Because we do not have the power as youth leaders to sack them. But if the president refused to act within the next uh, seven days, what we are hoping to do is to call ourselves as Nigerian youths that the time has now come for us to take our destinies in our hands. The Pan-African Youth Union is the coordinating body for youth activities in Africa and it works with members of the National Youth Council of the African Union member states across the continent. They also challenge politicians who are already conversing for support and vote for the next general elections to work with the present government to secure the country from obscurity, insecurity and bad economy. Helen Osamedei Kings, TVC News, Abuja.